Yo guys, Superior David here, and today we'll be starting off the new year in superior fashion by talking about Blastoise's super spicy ramp druid deck that I was absolutely destroying with the other day. I feel like people are really sleeping on this archetype for druid, and it's actually really good. I hit top 300 legend while I was a few beers in on stream, so let's just say I had a really fun time playing this deck. But I guess anyways, the general game plan here is that you want to ramp aggressively with the new Wild Heart Guff, who's actually just really powerful. Who would have thought, like, being able to get 20 mana is actually really good and then you know you also want to use the og like op uh ramp card overgrowth and then you want to like start using that extra mana in conjunction with like the powerful mana cheat cards that we run in this deck like the forest warden omu and the kaelthus sunstrider to basically just like combo cards together in the same turn like way earlier than you should be able to and i think like ideally you're looking to use uh the moonlit guidance and solar eclipse to just double up on certain powerful cards or effects that you know really change based on the situation and matchup but i I will say that Resizing Pouch, Survival the Fittest, and surprisingly Ysera were the cards that I felt myself gravitating towards the most. But, you know, don't be afraid to go for like an Umbral Owl or like a, you know, Scenarium Ward in matchups where like you're under a bit more board pressure. And with that, it's time for some Drunk Superior gameplay. So I'm sure you'll have some questions and you're free to ask those just down in the comments below. And I guess, of course, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. And I guess more importantly, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already, because I was like looking through, through the numbers and I was just blown away by like how how many of you aren't subscribed to watch my videos all the time? And I was just like, oh dang, we need to even those numbers out. So let's get on that. But anyways, I hope your new years are off to superior starts and I can't wait to just see where we go with Hearthstone this year. But I guess in the meantime, guys, you know, stay superior. I'll catch you on the next one later. Drawings are like a fine, fine wine, right? If you say so. I mean, I think you might be more the art expert than myself. The concept has to age. Ooh. I mean, honestly, this deck... Probably, I mean, I'm probably gonna go cold, cold, catch a cold tooth mine. I'm not gonna be really happy about it though, because I, I mean, I, maybe I would be happy about it in this situation though, because I do have, I do have some, some, uh, some ramp. Zim, Sonic the Hedgehog in under three seconds. That, I mean, that's, that's very on like, on like character for Sonic the Hedgehog. You know, being able to draw Sonic the Hedgehog fast. Chat, have you guys seen the, uh, the trailer for the new Sonic the Hedgehog movie, the, the second one? I, I joked with the superior lady. I was just like, hmm, what, what, what if I, uh. What what if I uh, for Halloween dress uh, dress up as Eggman or Robotnik? I don't know, I don't know what they call him. I think that I think he's still Eggman. I thought it'd be really funny though. I think she's a little mixed on on the on the concept. Jim Carrey, I know Jim Carrey is pretty pog. Ugh. Don't shadow step this, please. Don't shadow step this. Oh, Tenwu. Oh no, so they're running J. Alex's list with just no, uh, with Tenwu instead of Jandus, it seems. Oh boy. Trust no one. Not trust no one. You fell in love with him ever since Batman? Dude, I, I feel like just growing up in the 90s, it's, it, I was always just a fan of Jim Carrey. He rocks. What if I just, what if I go for a Lightning Bloom next turn? Draw those cost card, draw those cost. We'll go for this next turn. I'm gonna go Bogbeam, I'm gonna go Bogbeam on this. Yeah, you know, we got the we got Badway coming in with the follow, very superior. And Thor Yunko, Thor Yunko, if I miss your follow, I'm sorry. I've been drinking, so I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna miss some stuff here. I'm superior, but I'm 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 still a fallible human being, especially when um, you know getting a little liquored up. Well, that cannot be good. A, ma a mage a mage secret is never good coming from a rogue. So let's see how much mana do we have to work with. Technically not dead if I go for this. I think we go for it. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go for a guff amount of mana. And then next turn we scam. Oh, ho, 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 next. Oh wait, oops. Next turn we scam. Next turn we scam. Yo, Ash, welcome back. We're trying to figure out how we can scam this game here. How much mana do we have next turn? We will have ten. I think in case there's like a mirror to your counter spell, I might have to go for. Um, Omu. Oh, dang, they're going for the jugular here. They're going for the jugular. Please don't kill me. I just realized that we're coming up on scab mana here, too. Scabs could be really bad. Scabs could be a really bad time for us. 
So we're at six life. Um, we sent a wicked stab. All right, we're de we definitely gotta go, Ysera. Ysera's definitely gotta gotta clean some stuff up here. Hmm. We'll make this work. We'll make this work. So we go nurture. We gain a mana crystal. We play the Omu. Oh, oh man, Ro, I see you're saying stuff. I, I gotta, I gotta, gotta do my thing here real fast. I guess I didn't need to go for this. I guess my thinking was in case there was a mirror to you. I don't want to give him Ysera. So I think that's why I went for this. Uh, in case there's a counter spell, I don't, I think I want to keep this. I'm going to go for the coin here. This is fine. Um, now we go Ysera. I know you guys are talking to me right now. I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm in the zone here. I'm in the zone. David's trying to kick some butt and not die. Now we go for you. We go for this. And we stabilize. Okay, so right after your break over Christmas, you felt quite inferior and now feeling a little superior. Going, oh, Ro Ro Robo Ron, I'm happy to hear. I know. I, I, we basically I, I took some time off for the holidays. We were, we were going to visit my family. That sort of fell through due to COVID. But I'm happy to be able to still stream some more. And let's see. Uh, what's a good replacement for Omu in this deck? Or is he a must? Um, you know... You know, I guess you could probably make do with like... I mean, Omu... You saw what Omu... Omu could like allows you to just do some really scammy things. So... I feel like you want Omu in this deck. If you don't have Omu in this deck, it's not like the end of the world. But you definitely would prefer to have the Omu than not have the Omu. All right, let's see. We get, we definitely got to uh, throw this stuff off. And it'd be nice to get Taunt on, on the Ysera, too. I don't know if we can make that happen. Well, maybe, maybe we start off with just like a resizing patch, see what we get off this. They're just like, hmm, scrap your Colossus, you know. How like how do they push through this? I, I know I'm I'm locking you guys out right now. We gain a mana crystal. We go for this. And then I think we go for the nightmare. Just to we really don't want this dying. Hey legend, you missed the latest expansion launch and just kicked the computer over. Is it worth to get back into Hearthstone or nah? Um, you know, I think now is a, I mean, you know, we, we, we got like rotation coming up in a few months, so now might be like a more of a challenge time to get back into Hearthstone. But like if you want to get back in, you know, you could probably make it work. Uh, I think I think it's, it's something that becomes that'll become more challenging the longer you wait. Oh, please no devolving! I know if we get scammed off this, I'll be so sad. Ra Raxon, did I say something not cool? <laughs> Raxon's just like like the dot the, the dot 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 is so ominous, man. No, okay, okay. Oh my goodness. Are we not dead? I think we might not be dead. If we're not dead, that means we could maybe scam. So how much mana do we have access to next turn? We'll have 14. And we have 18 with with uh, the blooms. So I could go uh, bloom, bloom. Yeah, 18 with bloom, right? 18 with bloom. I need to get the uh, Scenarium Ward. Whoa, I did not see that hmm. All right, guys, we're gonna we're, we we gotta go for this because I need armor or else we're just gonna die to Scabs. Or sorry, we're gonna die to Mr. Smite. Oh, nice big head. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Let's see. Um, so we go Bloom. Bloom is eighteen. We play you. We missed all of our scenario wards, so help me freaking God. Oh, no, we're fine, because we go, uh, we get scenario ward every time here. Thank you. Okay, we do this. Um, we play you over here. We do this. This is tempo. We go for the Scenarian. 14. So we get a little, little bit of, a little bit of uh, breathing room here. 
They can't go, let's see, I think I just want to play for board here. I'm, I'm playing hard for board. I, mean, I should, actually should have gotten rid of this. I made a mistake. I should have gotten rid of this. Oh, uh, let's see. And let's see, we're going to just ban this person. Do it not kill the prime? Yeah, I, I, it was definitely a risk blast always. I guess they still have like a, I don't know. I don't know. It felt all right to me, but yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done it. God, Blastoise comes in here just just to, you know, be like, David, I would not have done that. It might screw us over later. It, might definitely, it definitely might screw us over later. So let's see, if I go Hero Power, I gain two mana. I really don't need that mana right now, though. Let's see. What else can I do with this one mana? I guess I still go for the mana. Gain a mana crystal. I'm sorry I'm ignoring you guys right now. I'm, I'm hard ignoring you guys because there's so much going on. Let's see, two, four, five. So, I mean, just in case, I'll still like, get rid of this. In case I'm like drunk and mess up my math. Okay, you out of here. Okay, I think we're. I think we can start stabilizing a bit. I think we can start stabilizing. We're at 30 life. Oh, it's finals because it's it is superior. It slaps pretty hard. But Darkstone, I hope you're doing well. Um. You run in your druid list. You thought you, only, you were the only one playing Kael'thas. I mean, it's all about Blastoise, man. Blastoise threw this this list together. Wow, that's interesting because I like if if they get Prime off this, that just becomes so bad. Like this becomes so bad. What's the game plan with this? Um, cheap mana, do broken things. And uh, destroy your opponent's hopes and dreams. I think that's the general game plan. Did I miss something there, guys? I think I think I hit everything. Oh wow! Wow. Okay, I like this play. I like this play, but now I can just go like Yasera. I go Yasera, and I go bounce, bounce. I just keep bouncing stuff back. Uh, let's see. Because now that they just don't have enough cards to draw to make Edwin good. I'm definitely worried about the Prime now, though. Prime's definitely going to be a concern. So let's see. If I ramp, I go... I still have 12 mana left, so I can still go for this. So I think I like going for that. I'm at 28. Time may pass, but the time <sighs> yeah, you start with over 10 mana is really nice. There we go. Get this stuff out of here. Oh, oh my goodness. Yeah, it's a really flexible deck. I mean, you saw, like, you know, like, the, the Kael'thas with the mana, like, the mana cheating really just allows you to scam some stuff here. I have one with the boy. And, like, okay, let's get draw draw all your deck. Just draw cards. Draw cards, buddy. Let's go. Draw some cards. Draw some cards. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah, the mage one. That's fine. Oh, that's fine. One more. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's fantastic. Oh. Oh, no, that can't be good. That could be bad. So I think we actually want. I think we just want to get the survival to fit us, so they can't like burst us down. So let's do this. Let's draw. We're gonna draw. Do I really don't want you? Hmm. I could go like solar resizing. Try to get uh, some taunts. We get you. I know, rip, poor Samro, man. And do something like this. Just get taunts on the board so they like because they, 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 they win this game by going for Edwin here, and now they can't go for Edwin. Edwin just became like bad. You know, I mean, Edwin Smite's not no longer good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh wait, he, oh my goodness, Blastoise, you're right. They, I didn't even realize what you were saying. They did get full value from Fonda Power. That was so bad. That's so bad for us. Random mage minions. Random mage minions. Oh no. Who is those guys? Who, what do you mean, who is those guys? Yeah, I mean, we got a Guff and we got a, we got a, uh, a Scabs. So you guys, so you guys want a, a Samro expansion? I mean, Samurai was like the face character of uh, the Barons, you know. 
Um, Edwin only keeps the buffs if, uh, oh. Edwin only keeps the buffs if you shadow step him first and then keep, like, playing stuff. I uh, no, I mean, we go for it. I don't know if it is lethal. According to my calculations, there's a lot of damage at my opponent's face. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is a giga lethal. This is giga lethal. How do we win that game? I've said it before on stream, you know, life is sort of, we, I think everything in life is bound to, you know, uh, Newton's third law, where like for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. And I feel like th that that carries across, not just like mat matter and whatnot, whatever like Newton was actually referring to, but to everything in life, where you really get what you, what you put into things. And it, 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 even, it even applies to the stream, you know, the more like, the more like, uh, you know, you guys put in the into the stream, the more we get out of it, you know, and same, same for me. I just realized I totally missed a follow. Uh, let's see. Uh, I missed no 63 piano. Thank you for the follow. And Ajani2766, thank you for the follow as well. Very superior. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. What, what, what a wild time to be in China, dude. Oh, Armor Ghost, you have a superior knight as well. I know, DM Rhythm, I had no idea. Oh, yeah, Blastoise. I could barely speak English. I mean, it's, it's actually really, uh, well, actually, well, first, uh, let's, I, let, I, let, before we get into that, I, I feel like I miss some other people. It was busy, busy. Hope you had, you and the better half had a, had a great time. You know, it's it, true. The spirit lady is my better half. Uh, but yeah, we had, we had a great time, dude. We canceled our flights home to see the family because we were worried about COVID. And we said we just had like a nice chill weekend, uh, just hanging out with the cat and each other. It was very needed. If I had a kid, what language would I encourage them to enroll in French, Spanish, Arabic, or Chinese? I mean, I, th I think Spanish is the most practical, but I think Chinese, Chinese is such a cool language. Um, I would I would love to just learn more Chinese and and get more into that. It's such, such a cool language. But I think Chinese is so sorry. Spanish is so much more practical. Like I like I live in freaking, I live in. Oh wait, oh man, Sir Sir Julian the Tall. I realized I did not. I never updated the code for this deck. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna do that right now. I'm so freaking sorry, dude. But anyways, yeah, living in California, China, uh, Spanish is so practical. Like. <laughs> We did like the, this Arcane pop-up, a uh, pop-up for the, the show Arcane on Netflix a, a few weeks ago. And afterwards, we went to get some like, you know, some street tacos. And it was so sad. Like watching me like order street tacos was like such a sad experience because I just don't know Spanish. And uh, like the superior lady's friend who was like literally just using her like Duolingo app to, to like brush up on her Spanish in the car, like couldn't help me out either. So I was just like, this this poor guy just hobbled, tried, just trying to like, his very hardest to order tacos that he like literally like it was, it was a struggle to get these tacos man i feel like both of these sort of suck uh can, i don't think i want to be overloaded next turn so i'll just go power of the wild and you know i'm just gonna i'm gonna make the dude i guess i could just go iron bark on this uh is the donkey style still not working with ages replay i do not know Russian for sure. Oh man, Ru Russian seems like a tough language. But yeah, Sir Julian the Tall here, dude. I got you covered. This this should be updated now. Gonna go play COD. Can't backs anymore. Oh, thank thank you, Blastoise. Thank you. I mean, if oh, if you keep up draws like this, I think it's gonna go quite quite well for us, dude. Oh my goodness, what a great draw. What a great draw. Feels good, man. Feels good. But uh, Blastoise, thank you, thank you for dropping the spicy, uh, spicy deck just right into right into my lap here. I really appreciate it, man. And, and I hope uh, you know you and your family are doing well. Sounds like you guys had a good holiday, and I hope that uh, you, you take you carry that momentum into a Happy New Year as well, man, because you, you guys deserve it, despite all the crap I give you. And I think I could have done some things differently there. I should have probably traded. No, 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 never mind. I shouldn't have traded. We're fine. We're fine. This is fine. This is fine. Um, I'm gonna just go for the Iron Bark, and then I'm gonna send this this fella face. Man, this could be good. This could actually be really good in this matchup. Because we do run a lot of spells. We really have no way to like take advantage of this. I think I'd rather actually just go for the best in shell. Which may seem like which may, may seem like an odd thing to go for, but when we don't have a way to like uh, to abuse the Glowfly Swarm, I feel like it just doesn't become good. Oh, yes. Love you too, man. Talk, talk uh, hot take about... Wait, how about take Mutinous? It may help in some conditions. Like, well, putting like Mutinous in this deck... Yeah, you know, maybe. I think I think the beauty of like a ramp druid deck is that it could, the list could be pretty flexible because you're just trying to abuse like lots of mana. So if you want to put mutants in this list, you know, more power to you. Scythe is, you know, you always you, you usually go for the gab jam these days. I'm a little disappointed that there's no gab jam. One of your friends, uh, boyfriends, flew home and the flight was delayed because someone vomited two rows in front. Of oh wow, Brian, that's yeah, that's that's scary. 
frankly, we, we were just super worried about like getting stranded in in uh, Chicago with with uh, if like we tested positive for COVID at any point. Let's get, let's get you out of here for sure. Let's get Yogg's run every time, please. And I'll go survival. I get. I guess if I have to go survival, what are we like, trying to get kill this? Let's try to get kill this. Oh, we'll go. Oh, we'll go goth by baby. We'll go goth baby. Oh my goodness, we got Umu. Oh, fe oh, fellas, fellas. And I think we. I think we just. We just keep. We keep riding it. We we keep riding it, man. We keep riding it. We're going for it. Oh baby, double guff all a double guff all the way across the sky. So the goal here would be to go um it would be to go uh best in shell with the solar survival to fittest. You can't hate guff, dude. You can't hate guff. Guff is amazing. Love love me some guff. Yeah, dude, very intense indeed. Wait, I could go Omu into Best in Shell into Survival, I think. Oh my. Ugh. Ugh, that's not good. We got this, guys. We got this. We got this. But yeah, Francisco, I've, I've, I, I mean, you know, I'm from the Midwest, so like we're all about like the, like the long, the, like the six hour drives on, on just like, just like that. I love me a long drive. We haven't been on one in a while, though. So let's yeah we go for you. This could maybe screw us over though. That's the one thing I'm sort of worried about here. Yeah, I can't even get the ramp in. I want to get the ramp in, but I can't because I want to go. I want to be able to go boom, boom. And if they can't clear this off, then we win. I mean, they have three cards over here. There's probably like a Bayrov over here, which sort of scares me. But if they don't have Bayrov, then we win. This is just a really unfavorite matchup, so I think we got to play a bit risky here. Yeah, but yeah, Francisco. I mean, like, it was sort of weird because, like, the weekend before the holidays, I was telling my dad, I was like, Dad, you know, we might not be flying home for the holidays because of COVID. We're sort of, like, thinking about it right now. Or actually, no, no, no. I, I, the superiority was actually, well, she, she was actually uh, out of town. She was, she was, like, on a little, like, a ladies' trip um, and not in town. But I was just sort of thinking to myself. And then... I, uh, like, then, like, by Tuesday, things had gotten, like, a lot, like, you know, things really started blowing up, and he was just like, you know, yeah, David, probably for the best. Is the quest too greedy if added? You know, Punk, I think the quest doesn't really just work in this deck, because we don't have enough ways to sort of, like, to make it work. There is a quest that, uh, Hapu Gabu did hit Legend, or Rank 1 Legend, though, with a really good quest druid list, if you want to play quest druid. Yeah, M Macho Ryush, I thought last week was going to be the last one too, but uh, as I was just saying, we sort of we, we had to cancel our, our plans for the holidays, or at least our travel plans. So uh, therefore, I'm in town and can still stream. So um, that is that is why I'm still streaming. Ah, nice, Brian. I, I like that. I like that thinking. I mean, I, the first, I, I, I think I played, like, I was playing, like, Burgle Rogue, like, for the past, like, week, it seems like, and then I switched to Quest Druid a little bit the other day. Oh, wait, hold up, hold up, David's got a scam, David's got a scam. There has to be a way to scam right now. There we go, we start off with you. We always get the Yogg. We don't play Yogg, though. We go for the Moonlight Guidance. Um, if I could push through this, I actually just win. Oh yeah, wait, I just win, right? Because I go Samuro, yeah, we just win. So we do this. Filthy, filthy, oh, wow. I mean, yeah, this is 23 damage over here, I'll just do this for the lulls. Oh, oh, dirty, dirty. And hey, yo, let's see who who came in with the file there. We got Dragon, Dragon Born, Bornger ninety five. Think of the file, very spear. It's a legit copy, not just a new copy. Oh yeah, dude, it's a copy. It's a copy. That was pretty filthy. That was pretty filthy.
Get that.